In this video, I'm gonna show you how I balance my solo props, both hub and the blades. I'm using the Dubrow balancer that I got from amazon.com and also the EJH balance rod that I got from amazon.com. Some scotch tape. I know there are purists out there that do not use tape. I do. The purists like to sand their blades and everything and sure, I'm sure it looks great. I do it the easy way. Then I borrowed some nail polish from my wife and that's what I'm going to use as the uh, for hub balancing. A lot of people use super glue, but I don't want to bother with that. Okay, first thing, you take your prop, stick it on the rod, put it on the balancer, and it's going to fall one way or the other. It, unless it doesn't move, then you've got a balanced prop. Now you can see that it sounds it feels like the bottom is uh, is a heavy. Okay, I'm going to now place a piece of tape on the side that, the opposite side of which way it fell. Now there are schools of thought that you put it over the front here. Uh, I don't do that. I'm just gonna put it underneath. Now I place my blade back on and that's good. If you got that, you're done. Now, most likely your if you set it to any other position other than horizontal, you've got the blades balanced now. Now you need to balance the hub. The hub is this piece right here where you screw your rod into. So if it's not balanced, then if you set it to this position, it will move. You should be able to set it to any position, as you can see, it's just coming back to the middle position. So that means the hub needs a little work. Now, if it's coming up like that, it means that it's bottom heavy. So I'm gonna paint the top of the hub with some nail polish. Now, all I do is I take and I paint Add some thickness to this. Now, just like with nail polish on your wife's fingernails, it's gonna have to dry. You can blow on it and do whatever. But that will take some time. Once you've given it time to dry, you should now go ahead and mount it back on the rod, place it back on the balancer, and you should still have horizontal, which you had before. But now if we move it to, let's say, this position here, it should stay. If we move it to this position there, it should stay. It really should stay at any position you put it in. That's how you know you got it balanced. And that's all there is. Nail polish, scotch tape, Dubro balancer, EJH rod, and some blades. How hard is that? Thanks for watching. Please hit the subscribe button if you like what you saw.